Oh, so we just slayed one of the two. Uh, we're gonna see if they come back, if they spawn back as alive um, after you kill them. So the reason I say that is because every other boss, once you kill it, they don't come back. So it'll be interesting to see if you have to kill them as a pair, or if um, if you have the ability to not do that. Ooh, hey, hey, you're out of pocket, dude. Really out of pocket at this point. Okay. Yeah, no, feeling confident though. The uh, one thing, if he is back, one thing I learned is that we have a lot more um, ability to attack than I thought. Wop, wop, wop. If, in the case that they are both back, uh, we will just try that strategy just a little more aggressively. Uh, we kind of had it towards the end there, but we had already wasted like most of our flasks. Um, but I'm, I'm feeling confident. None of the bosses yet. The other, the Spider Queen, really, I guess that's a standard for the rest of the bosses in the game for me because I've been cruising through the rest of the bosses that we face. Let's see. Oh, we got one or two. They're both back. Okay. We already killed you, you bitch. Let's go pick up our souls. Oh, we rolled right into it. lost 20,000 souls. Alright. You win some, you lose some. We do really well on some, we do really poorly on others. We're at 107 deaths, so let me update that. Update that real quick. Yeah, no, not bad though, not bad guys. Not bad one bit. Yeah. Oops. Close this and, and let me actually hit this. Guys. You guys don't see me exit. You don't see me tab out. And then we can fix that. Easy pog. Alright. So. Viable strategy. Something we might be able to do. I think we got a little caught. We went in, uh, swinging like Mayweather, and I think we need to go in not doing that. Swing like, uh, park bench, park swing. Our first strategy of taking our sweet time seemed to work, and that seems to work for, like, every boss in this game, is just seeing kind of what they do first, um, and then progressing. So, like, uh, my, you know, five-head play by me. Uh, letting letting them show me what their attacks were before I decided to kill one of them. So we might do that strategy mixed with a little bit more attacking. And once we get into the groove of things, we'll, we'll cruise right through this, this pair. I'm a little worried about the electric hammer though. Uh, that could that sounds like it could be troublesome. It looked like it could be troublesome. It's kind of cool that they absorb each other's powers though. When they die. Alright. Eustace flags. Got that ready. We have. Oh, I probably just pulled the boss. I probably just pulled. Do we have anything else that would help us? Uh, just in case of emergencies, if we get super close, it'll be good to have that on our, um,. Yeah, look at acquire many souls or create unique weapons. It'll be good to have that. Oh, we can equip that too. Why not? What else? That's it. We don't want to use our twin, our twin humanities. Whoops. I also don't want to fall off and take damage for no reason. Oh my god. Alright, this isn't the one. We're stuck. Can hit me with an arrow too? Alright. 
So we're going after Ornstein. Lightning Boy first. Zenetsu first. Speaking of Zenetsu, Demon Slayer today. Is anybody excited for that? I know I am. Oh, 87. 87. Oh my gosh. Alright, so, new plan. Do what we did before. Backtrack. We're gonna moonwalk like Michael Jackson. That was a good opportunity to hit him. Alright. No! You guys need to be in my view. Yep, that's why, right there. Uh, so what I'm doing right now is I'm showing you guys how not to fight them, and then eventually uh, I'll show you exactly what you should do. But watch, follow me for more tutorials on, on Dark Souls bosses. Yep, okay, so we hiding behind these with the big dude seems to be a really viable strategy. I'm almost wondering. Oh, if we could backstab him. That'd be lit. You know your boy likes to backstab. Ebus. I want his hammer, let's 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 be real. As a hammer man in Monster Hunter. That was close. I risked that. I risked it all there. Still look cool. I like how his armor has tits. So That's so funny. Alright, Ornstein, get over here. He's like, I know you killed me once, so I'm gonna hide. We could also see what the cutscene is for killing him first. Easier to kill first. The attacks seem more linear than the big dude. Oh my god, dude, did we just actually figure out the trap? Completely behind it. There we go. Oh. Alright, he moved me. He didn't want me to get hit by the lightning bolt. Secretly, we're friends. Healing. He seems like he's easier to take out than I originally thought. It's the giants. Dude, the iron golem didn't give us any problems either. So maybe leaving him for a second is better. We're not going to have to heal again until we beat one of them. Healing. Big play, big play. me. Let's see if that was the play. We still have three heals left, right? Ooh. Down goes Fraser. Ew, I don't like his armor anymore. His, uh, his faceplate looks like the Taco Bell dog. Got, like... Oh, he got bigger. Did he get bigger? 
Yup, he definitely got bigger. Nah, maybe not. Bring it! We have a lot of health heals left. Is he a caster now? Caster means unite. Yeah, but him being a giant now means that we can go through his legs. Oh, I think the big dude is a better play to take out first. Oh, dude, what did you eat for a lunch? How do we know when he does that? We were smart, we take him out like half health and then take out the other dude and then let him be big. Yeah, cause that's gonna, you can't do that too often. So much, uh, whatever this is called, the green bar is called a block. Eustace, no, Eustace Flash, no. He's gonna pop up and dump it. you figure out their moveset, the game's not that hard. So anybody who's looking for an actual tip instead of just comic relief, I would suggest letting them display their full moveset to you. Stamina, <laughs> it is. I was, I was kidding. Thank you, though. That's funny. Getting quicker. Did I kill us? Fuck. Alright. So I think. The play is let's bust open one one boss soul. Who is though? Soul of Queenlag, Soul of Iron Golem. Oh, dude, Ducky, thanks, dude. I appreciate it. I'm enjoying it. I think this game is great. Uh, I used to rage at it all the time, but now I'm now I'm I'm loving it. Let's do Soul of Q-Lag. I think, I think that's the one. She's, my, so my reasoning for this is she is before the Iron Golem. So I think therefore her, the stuff that you can make with her soul is not as good. Let's do that. Let's use that item. A convert? I don't know what that means, but I'll take it. I don't know what a convert is. Oh, 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 it's what I said. Duh. <laughs> <laughs> yes, no, I uh, played the- I, I was a young, I played Dark Souls 3, uh, and I did not like it, and uh, now I'm loving it, I'm like addicted, I was just telling my brother I want to quit streaming it, and then because I was stuck 
before sends Fortress. Only at 8,000 souls. I was expecting like 30,000 souls. Oh shit, well that was a waste. Um, might have to do the other one too, just to see if we can get a level. Four of Iron Golem. Alright, maybe we can get a level off that. Level up. <laughs> we can get one level, literally one. Ah, uh, shit. Okay, so that would give us two more weapon damage with our right hand. My raw longsword uh, is level s raw seven, I think, or raw five. Let me look. We have twenty thousand souls. We are raw four. Raw four. Can't we can't upgrade it anymore right now for some reason? I, don't, I think I'm missing the mats. level let's level endurance Roz and an up a get upgrade path oh no well you know what they say all your choices in this game are permanent it feels like anyway we're definitely learning uh, by example of what not to do and it's it's uh, it's a good time So I think we kill Big Fat Boy first, uh, and then we go for go for the Dragon Killer second. I think that's still I think that's our plan. I really that we switched halfway through that last fight. It really is, and I love it. I love that I'm bad at it, so that later in life or later in my streaming career, I can be good at it. Plus, being bad at stuff is good for content, so. Wah, wah, wah. What's in that box in that room? Anybody know? There's a big, uh blind guardian in that room and then there's like three boxes and i couldn't touch him yesterday i mean i had a i had like a, a scythe maybe i don't know i had something else other than oh that's not fair I, oh 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 my god dude what is this game i'm glad we didn't waste our humanity or our other thing I was just saying that yesterday too. Uh, I got, I just got punched on the way there, and I didn't heal. And look what happens. I, I just wanted to uh, look at the scenery on, and the paintings on the wall one more time. We're uh, we're at 109, 109 for deaths. That's funny, dude. That was that was n no bueno. I don't know. I almost think I was really expecting way more souls off of a boss soul. Probably should have saved it for weapons then. Uh, but that's alright. We're learning. I think if I was to play through the game again, I said uh, yesterday I'd be a spellcaster. Like either that or the thief. I really like like rogues and thieves in games. Um, and the backstab mechanic in this game seems like a rogue move. Which I like. I'm a fan of. What? Wow. 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 Oh, okay, good. So I'm not really missing anything. Um. Yeah. So I guess I should have used them earlier and then leveled up. I guess the only way to really farm souls is to farm souls. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna run right by the trash in this room. I wasn't talking about me. I am trash, so. 
Okay, so he's gotten a swipe on us the last two times we've ran through this. So if we go deep this way, and deep that way, I think we'll be good if we over-exaggerate. Hey, look, our souls. The game was like, you didn't even make it through the fucking window last time. Okay, wouldn't let me lock on. Oh my god, dude, I'm not ready. He doesn't charge as long as I thought he did the first two times he did that to me. Are we sure we beat this once already? I've killed them both individually now. they can poke through each other. I think that's an exploit. Run! We ran! Alright. Yeah, I think in the future games, like in uh, Elder Ring, Elden Ring, they should hit each other. They should do boss damage to themselves because in real life if i was to fight two demigods like that they would hit each other and their weapons would clash or they would do damage to one another they would not face through but you're breaking my immersion from software Dust animation turning to ash. The cinder. Are we now? Cinder is Dark Souls 3. So, is the story for Dark Souls 2 related to this story? Like, do you play the same uh, Undead? Or do you play something totally different? Is this in the same universe? Different story? like that we got big chunky boots on and like a medium armor i wonder if we could put on one more is there a way to see like our weight limit equip load 33 we have 40 equip load to to play with this one is 5.9 how can we not equip this they're different, they're not, yeah, barely related. Okay, that's good. Uh, so we should be able to equip this now. And not, not roll. Like our equip load, it's, is it a strength thing then at that point? Um, where did I see equip load before? Equip load is 47.5 out of 74. So why are we rolling? Why are we fat rolling? That's interesting to me. That makes us fat roll as well. We could always upgrade a leather armor. Oh, okay. You were, yeah, you were saying that the other day. Okay. So. And the leather armor it is. Although I was thinking about, uh, you said to play naked. I'm thinking like if I did that, you know, I'd be able to roll a lot better and further and, um, dodge way more. <clears throat> Which as it, what's funny enough, as I progress with the game, I'm dodging way more now. All right, so new strategy. We're gonna we're gonna kill the big dude first. We're gonna get this dude down too. 
So I'm just going to attack whichever one wants to attack me. Uh, and then we'll get them both down pretty low. That's the plan of attack here. Didn't hit us, but okay. I want to see you up. Oh, yeah, I think we're good. Dude, he literally chased us all the way across the map. Yeah, but uh, honestly, the whole game feels so much easier now. I don't know, something just clicked the other day, and now all of a sudden I'm just like rolling through all the bosses. The Spider King really fucked me up. Oh, shit, little folks. He just jumps out of nowhere. You think so? I thought I was doing pretty good on damage. <laughs> we uh, we got stuck yesterday for a while using a broken, a non-broken weapon. Cause mine had like very low health. But I don't know where to get a better, a better longsword. Do I just pick something and upgrade it? Cause our long, or I would have to un-upgrade it and then uh, use the boss's souls or use some something else to upgrade the weapon that I have now. Ooh, big chunk. That's so stupid. Sure. Let me die on purpose here. Oh, fuck, perfect. <laughs> Alright, so... Mind showing me your weapon, so yes, I will do that. So I used... What did I use yesterday? We have a short sword, short sword, raw sword, long sword, broad sword. We have a bunch of broken swords that I don't know what to do with. Uh, the man serpent great sword is what we used yesterday. Oh, really? Yeah, they don't explain that very well. We have this, but we can't use any of them. Um, we don't have enough dexterity. This one, we don't have enough weight, I guess. Because weight is 10, that would put us over. Um, the Painted Guardian Sword, I think, yeah, we don't have enough dexterity. Enough dexterity. Enough dexterity. All of the issue really seems to be that we just didn't level dexterity at all. Battle axe would be all right. Maybe leveled up. Nope. Dexterity, dexterity. Great axe, not enough strength. Morning star. Ah, uh, whoops. Yeah, requires eleven. Got a dragon's tooth, and that requires forty. That would do a lot of damage, I bet. Oh, I can just look at him, okay. I didn't realize that. But yeah, that's really, that's where we're at. The man, the great sword. Yeah, so we used that yesterday and I actually really liked it. Um, why don't we, you know what? I don't think, we have to go get our souls and um, home bone our way out of there. Which might work. You think that would do more damage than the current sword that we're wrecking, repping? See you wow. Because wow. aesthetically, I, I would love to rock that the whole time. Well, so that's our plan right now. We'll grab our souls in Homeward Bone. Glad we lost like 30,000 souls. I also have like a bunch of um, upgrade materials, I think. Wow, wow. Let me see you. 
You've killed me a hundred times, he says. I won't let it happen again. I've literally only used this longsword and then, uh... That's really all I've used. <laughs> so I, have, I haven't had to upgrade anything because it's been at max upgrade every time we find a new blacksmith. I even ran back yesterday or the day before to upgrade it again when we were in Sen's Fortress. Uh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I just don't like giants in this game. We beat the Iron Golem literally, I don't know, maybe in five minutes in. Alright, Homer Bone is ready. We have 13,000 souls. Oh, please don't die. Yes. <laughs> Alright, we'll try it again. And 112 deaths. 112. Oof. Honor and Honor. I don't think that used our homeward bone. Maybe it did. Probably if you get stuck in the animation, then it probably uses it. Let's go grab that then. 